This was the scene one year ago, a story of tragedy. And this is the scene now, an empty lot. On their own, American Legion Post 40 members demolished the building. A year after the fire and nearly two after the floods, Post Commander Robert Harper says it's still hard to comprehend. And these two hardships are really uh, was a blow to this American Legion post here. But this is a story of a new beginning. We've been working diligently trying to get it back up. Bill Shu says the process to build a new building is already underway. They're working with Venture Engineering to start the next chapter in this story. They're going through the permitting process to get the new building up, and this time around, they're not taking any chances with flooding. We decided if we ever did anything again, we'd move back from the waterway and gain altitude above sea level, and that in itself would uh, protect us a lot. That's why the new building will be here, closer to the front gate instead of here, closer to the waterway where the old building was. Every good comeback story has a strong, motivated protagonist. Harper says that role is filled by the members of Post 40. Veterans, we got some of the finest veterans in the world here. And in the face of adversity, he says his team will never quit. And they don't give up, and they're not gonna let this stop them either. While the final page of this story is yet to be written, Shu says thanks to the determination and military spirit of the Post members, this story will have a happy ending. When it puts you down, you just get back up. You're gonna come out on top one way or the other. You're not gonna be defeated. That's what we're taught. It'll be built back. <laughs>